Hello and welcome to the Computer Lab Vids YouTube channel uh, and in this video I'm going to show you how to set uh, your default browser within your Mac OS so if you want to use Google Chrome or Firefox uh, this is how to set the defaults. I'm Grant Rhodes and I'm the founder of the Computer Lab. Okay so the first thing to do is go into the top left hand corner uh, you'll see the little Apple sign and in there you want to go down to system preferences. These are where most of your defaults are kept so once you open the system preferences box, as you can see here, uh, we have multiple options. The one that we want is the one on the top left that says general. We click on general and then straight away we have the options here. And the default web browser on this machine is currently set to Safari. So I've just put a small um, URL link here that uh, opens my default browser. So as you can see there, as I double click the link, it opens uh, my YouTube channel. Um, so that is currently opening the Safari. I know it's Safari because, well, one, I can tell it's Safari because it's just by the look, but also if I just highlight the uh, section, you can see there in the top left-hand corner, it tells me that I'm currently using Safari and viewing that URL in Safari. Okay, so obviously you need a browser installed. So if you haven't installed the browser, make sure you install it first. Okay, and I've installed Google Chrome. I want to set my default web browser to Google Chrome, so I literally set it in the default web browser there. Double click the URL I've just put as a sample and it will open up the default browser. So you don't have to click save or anything like that. If you're used to Windows, all you need to do is just set the default web browser in the general settings and then you can tell obviously we've just opened in Google Chrome. It is as simple as that. Uh, just to double check and just prove that it still works, just double click the URL again. So if you get the same sort of links within a um, email or something like that you can see there that as soon as you click a link it will open in whichever default browser you set and likewise if you want to go back and change it back uh, to safari or firefox like say if you're using a different one literally just go up to the system preferences again into the general tab select your browser and you see there as i double click it it now opens in safari so it is as simple as that just to set it's not really nothing, nothing tricky it's not um it, if you're used to Windows, it's a bit more in depth just to change some of your default programs, especially now in Windows 10. Uh, but Apple are still keeping it nice and clean on how you to uh, change um, some of the settings. So just as an extra, I thought I'd just show you how to set your home page in Safari. So unless something's overridden the default settings, it will probably go to an Apple site. So this is the one that opens a default when you open up uh, Safari. Um, and this is the page that you'll see straight away. I like to set mine to Google. So the first thing to do is obviously um, open Safari. You know you've got it open by the menu at the top left. Click on Safari down into preferences. Once you're in preferences, you get this familiar box. Make sure you're on the general tab at the top here. You do have other options as well. Um, which I'm not going to go into detail here, but uh, the one that we are going to be working on is the general tab. So once you're in the general tab, you'll notice here you have several options. So there's um, a couple of nice little features in here. So, so currently set Safari opens with a new window. You can see there and a new window open with favorites. And on the right hand side, they're all the favorites, the sites that I've been on. Um, I I don't really like this setup. I want mine to go to a home page. Like I said before, I like mine to be Google. But I'll just quickly go through the settings here. So you want to set the new window starts and opens with home page, a new tab opens with home page. Uh, and this box here is the one that we're going to type into in a second. But I'm just going to quit and just go back in just to show you what it looks like again. So I've currently set it to open on the home page. Now I didn't change the home page. So again, we need to go back in Safari and down to preferences again into the general options, make sure your tab's there. Now this is the page that has just opened up. So I want to set this to uh, Google. And all you can literally do is just uh, just type in there. If you're already on Google, you can use the button just underneath, set to current page. But I'm just gonna set the uh, homepage to Google. Um, obviously I'm in the UK, so .co.uk. Like I say, you can use that set to current page if you're already on Google in the browser and it will just paste it in there. Uh, once you click, um, this to come out it will uh, check and say okay are you sure you really want to do this and basically it wants you to look at the apple stuff i want to go to google yes so um okay with that i'll close everything down again and then once we uh, reopen it here i'll just quit it properly because um just so we can see it from refresh so we'll open safari so now we should get the google page um and also we obviously just do a quick search just to 
proves you that it's uh, that's what's happening and also if we go to a new tab i set the new tab as well to open in google so as you can see um there we're all we're all good and if we click that url link it uh, currently set to safari so it will open another tab again okay so thanks for watching uh, my channel and this video uh, any comments below are always appreciated and please do subscribe it helps me keep doing these videos thanks for watching